Hello, hello, and welcome back to the show. Today I'm going to be doing a spoilery recap of this book, so I hope you enjoy this. It is going to be full of spoilers, so if you don't know anything about this book, you haven't read it yet, simply go down to the description down below, click on the link, that will take you to a page where you can read the blurb to find out non-spoilery things about this book. But otherwise, I'm going to get right into the spoilers. This is a science fiction dystopian that I gave 4.5 stars. I loved getting to see Gonzalo. I didn't really remember him from the first three books in the series, but he is an awesome character. He's an outcast, but he has a crush on Sasha, who is a mouse, a gang that travels through the vents and steals from other groups. She lets him join, but Baxter hates him because he wants to be with Sasha. When he sees Gonzo is growing, he locks him in a room for three months, at which time he won't be small enough to crawl from the vents to get revenge. Gonzo, alone again, hides in the section of the school with all the seniors' dead bodies and pretends to be an animal, even pooping in the hallways so people will fear him. When the loners from a gang form a gang under the leadership of David and Varsity decides to come after them, Gonzo joins the loners. Eventually, he gets out and the infected Eventually, he ages out, and the infected, including Sasha, who had left the mice to be with him, escape the school. He promised her he'd find her, so he spends six months searching the infected zone, and finally gets a lead and a gas mask from a guy crushed by his sealed van and searching for his son. Gonzo says he'll find the boy while looking for Sasha, but winds up finding Baxter instead. So the former enemies team up to find Sasha. Adults are trying to kill the infected, so the kids want to kill the adults or use them as slaves. In the end, they find her. Baxter had pretended he and Sasha were in love after they escaped, just to anger Gonzo. But she is still very much so only in love with Gonzo. I liked getting chapters with them following falling in love at the school, and I liked that he risked his life to come save her. I would have liked a little more on what happened after he saved her, and if anyone was ever able to stop the adults going on a killing spree. Alright, that's all I've got for you. Thanks so much for watching, and if you have a book that you would like for me to read and recap, please let me know down below in the comments, and I will see y'all in the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share with your friends, and I will see you all later. Thanks for watching. Bye!